I'm going to prove the power rule for derivatives. So the power rule says that you have a function f of x, which is x to the n, then the derivative of f to the f of x will be equal n times x to the n minus 1. So, let's look at the derivative of f of x and the definition of a derivative. So, f of x will equal x plus 8 to the n, or better, the limit as 8 approaches 0 of x plus 8 to the n minus f of x over 8. Now, what is f of x? f of x is just this. So let me rewrite this and also include the limit because I forgot here. So limit as 8 approaches 0 of x plus 8 to the n minus x to the n over 8. Now, if we expand this binomial, it becomes the limit as 8 approaches 0 of x to the n plus n, n choose 1 times x to the negative 1 times 8, then it continues on until it's just 8 to the n, then minus x to the n. And this is all over 8. So, next step. These two will cancel because it's positive and negative. Then becomes limit as 8 approaches 0. But also, this 8 divides all these 8s on top, so it becomes 8 to the n minus 1, and here it disappears. So then we're left with also n choose 1 is just n times x to the n minus 1. This cancels, then dot 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 until 8 to the n minus 1. Now, because 8 approaches 0, all the other terms except from this are dependent on 8. And when 8 becomes 0, they become 0. So what we're left with is that the derivative of f of x is equal to n times x to the n minus 1.